Hey YouTube, it's Miranda, and today we're on the GoPro because today we're going on an excursion. Excursion? I'm tired. I just got up. We're going on an excursion to the Duns River Falls here in Jamaica, and then we're also going shopping. Actually, I think we're going shopping first, so that we're not like soaking wet for shopping. Excited to see what this is all about. We we booked through the hotel, and we get like a well. They offered us two times, 10 or two, but then they were like, if you just want it to be you two, you can go whenever you want. And we're like, okay, is it the same cost? And they're like, yeah. So I was like, okay, so private tour basically, and it doesn't cost anything extra, let's do it. But we still chose to leave at 10 so we can get on with our day. And then later we can probably have some time to explore the resort a little more, maybe like go paddle boarding or something before we leave tomorrow. We need to go get Jordan some water shoes. I'm borrowing my friend Sinidris. Thank you so much, girl lifesaver because I have beautiful water shoes at home that I didn't bring so I'm like oh do I want to I like I didn't want to buy another pair of water shoes from the resort let's go hi how you doing All right, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let you try the local crop market first, okay? All right. And then we're gonna go down in the town where you can do the souvenir shops. Okay. The souvenir shops has like coffee, t-shirts and- Okay. Exactly. All right, this is the Cool. Let's go on the left here. Yeah. Oops. Okay, so our first stop is the pineapple craft market. Oh yeah. This is my little food here. We oh yeah. Start here shopping. Okay. Cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Someone makes this stuff or yeah. No doubt. <laughs> I know that's the answer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Camera. Yes. yes. Yeah. Records. Uh, I make YouTube videos. So. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. Share my channels. I tell everyone, come to the pineapple girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Some cool stuff. Get like a weed pen. A weed pen. Not like a. Not like a no, not, not a weed not like, pen. Not like that. A like weed a pen. pen. Yeah, I get her that for work. My mom works at, in a K to eight school, so. A weed pen may not go over well. Now we're at the second shopping center. This is called Taj Mahal, and one of the people at our resort told us not to come here. It looks like that in the center, and then there's all these shops around the edge, just like any other like plaza. But I think it's a lot of like, it's just not um, handcrafted or authentically made in Jamaica, a lot of the stuff. Is that what you're getting the vibe? Yeah. Just got this seasoning in there and then I asked for if I could get a dollar change in Jamaican so we could take it home. It's actually a hundred dollars Jamaican, but it's it's about a dollar fifty uh, US dollars, right? One US dollar is about dollar. So so that's all we got here. I think we're gonna try and head to the Duns River Falls now because I think we've done all the shopping we care to. And then the other thing is that people are saying that on the resort or like some of the stuff they sell to the tourists isn't the authentic like coffee and the authentic beer. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it is. I'm not a coffee drinker or a beer drinker really. So for, we're not gonna try to get any of those things, but just if you're wondering, oh, I think that's our, our van in the middle there. So our thoughts on this shopping excursion are that, I mean, it's all the same stuff you'll see in touristy places. They have like their, Jamaican rum and their Jamaican coffee. Um, the t-shirts are standard. County fair. Oh yeah, that kind of stuff. Like, like that the, kind of stuff. Yeah, because like the booths, they have like the wraps for, like uh, cover up wraps and except here there's a lot of weed wraps, there's a lot of bombs, yeah. there's a lot of penises. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> there's a lot of penises. <laughs> anyway, our driver's back. So we're gonna head to the next part of the excursion, which is the waterfall. Very excited about that. Some nature. Can't go wrong with nature, right? Unless there's bugs, yeah. Like in Jamaica, I mean, uh, Hawaii, when we went on our honeymoon, we went to the uh, the road to Hana. Didn't love that. So we parked back here. There's bathrooms over here, I think. Man, it says $10 water shoe sale. Smart. 
Huh. And locker rental. I don't know how much for the um, locker rental. Okay, so we already have our tickets from the resort, so we're headed in through here, following our driver. He's taking care of it for us. All right, we just had to sign this real quick. <laughs> There's a craft market here too that you can shop at. Oh, that's the whole thing here. Yeah, we've got craft market, central gardens, gift shop, tranquility, gar tran tra <laughs> tranquility garden, locker rental, falls beach, change rooms, toilets, nurse station. We didn't do any research for this, but they just said it's run by the government, so they keep it up updated, they run it. Okay, so we got a locker, it's right behind us, somewhere behind us, and it's with a key, so I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna keep it safe while we're on here, but I think we're about to go. You rent your locker here, you get it over there, there's a little cafe right here. Now we're waiting for our tour to start, our guided tour at the Duns River Falls. This is our ticket in, they put a wristband on. We weren't gonna get a locker. I, I put everything in like plastic so that it wouldn't get wet, but I didn't know there were lockers. So when I saw what they were and stuff, I was like, okay, I'm cool with that. And I tied the key right here and it's in my shorts. So I hope it stays. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah, I think this is a pretty physical activity. So I think we'll be happy to not have to carry around the, that whole bag. Yeah, I guess you can like hold hands wet. on the way up and stuff. I don't know, I'll show you as much as I can. You have to have your entry to go down this way, but you probably put away all your money by the time you get down here. Yeah. But there is another um, stand. There's also zip lining here. They're like going across this cable up here. So we made it back from our excursion. Now we're sitting by the pool with our Pizza Hut that we just got. <laughs> Jordan, if there's a Pizza Hut wherever we go, he will find it and we will order from it. So, we got some cheese sticks. Orlando! He's our friend. <laughs> okay, we gave away a box of cheese sticks to our fun uh, workers here at the Sandals Resort because they've been, they've been awesome. And Jordan's favorite, Steph Crust Pizza. That's really what we came here we looking for. Awesome. Is it everything you wish for and more? Oh, <laughs> I'm so glad. Okay guys, so we had our lunch. We went, we went back to the room for a little bit and packed up because we leave tomorrow at like 6.45 and we wanted to go in the water again and we get dinner later at like 6.30 
and then probably spend some time with our friends that are still here and then we'll pretty much be ready to just like throw the rest of our things in our bag and be ready to roll out of bed in the morning and get out of here which will be sad because we've had a really awesome time we're just in the water now at the resort there's sandals like there's a boat here back there there's stuff to do like snorkeling paddle boarding i don't know what else you can do here but i think you can catch like excursions from around here or something yeah they dock up probably at the end there yeah load everybody on the boats i like this beach over here it's pretty well i was just gonna say it's quiet but they just started some music like right as i was about to say that but there's really shady chairs over here which is nice because you can come out here and be in the sun in the water and then go lay in a chair under the trees there's also chairs right over there that are in direct sunlight full sun full sun as far as our excursion we had a lot of fun the shopping i thought it was good yeah. yeah like it was it was just like you have to you have to be ready to say no that's all yeah you have to be comfortable saying no you have to be comfortable haggling you have yeah. to have enough cash don't feel bad oh yeah bring more cash because what do we have i think you we brought 80 for, for the whole trip you brought like 80 dollars worth of five dollar bills because right. we planned on just using cash to tip like we didn't really think we'd do any excursions and stuff having friends here and so much to do at the resort but then we kind of got interested in doing an excursion and then obviously when you go out you end up buying stuff so i mean we didn't buy anything expensive like we only spent the 52 dollars on souvenirs and we got quite a few things and then we asked our driver to take us to pizza hut which worked out because we could buy him lunch instead of having like a big tip for him mm -hmm. so we got him lunch and then gave him like a pretty small tip i wish we had more cash but we're just out of cash and i need to save a couple dollars for tomorrow because we're gonna have a driver that takes us two hours back to the airport so like i'd like to give him a couple dollars and then the falls were awesome like totally recommend that you absolutely need water shoes i don't think i even recommend like crocs i did see a couple people in crocs they looked like they were slipping and sliding it's not that slippery there's just random spots just like if you're like rock hopping in a river or something like there are some rocks that are slippery yeah but most of them were i felt pretty grippy i just feel like crocs have like no grip yeah, it really was a great adventure. I would highly recommend it. Yeah. Uh, if you don't bring, if you don't bring water shoes, yeah. you can buy water shoes there. at the falls for ten dollars, which $10, was great. Which yeah. Which is the cheapest we found. He and paid twenty five dollars here at the resort, and I borrowed our friends, so that was awesome. What else? You walk up the falls like holding hands, so which I kind of wish I just had my hands available because holding hands felt more unsafe. Like, if one yeah. goes down, you're all going down, right? I don't know. It was only for the first part that you had to hold everybody's hand. I mean, they made like a big old chain of people. Over there. Yeah, yeah. Um, but all in all, it was nice. The tour guide was good. He did. He made like jokes along the way, and they're personable and friendly, and it was fun. So don't be afraid to. Uh, I won't say do your own thing, but like, oh yeah, like you're you're basically walking single file up this against the flow of water the whole way, and if and you stop along the way here and there and you do a couple things but don't be afraid to just stop on your own and like step off take a picture take a like pictures, if right. there's like a little like pool of water that looks like it's fun to sit in go ahead and do it there was a, a spot that was like a a water slide, slide yeah. and i don't think it recorded because when jordan gave the camera back to me it wasn't rolling and i'm like no but it was fun so definitely check that out if you want to do it more than once don't be afraid go ahead yeah do it yeah if you have any questions about any of these excursions or anything about the Sandals Resort or anything you've seen in these videos over the past few days, please leave them in the comments. I'll be happy to answer. I like to be helpful for you guys planning your trips. All right, we're gonna go for our last swim here at Sandals Ochi and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you never miss a video. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.